We've been using this Great Basin saddlebag for a couple days out here around Bend, and it's actually proven to be really great. Uh, this is essentially their largest of the saddlebags before you get to their pannier setup. And, you know, we did an overnight trip, and it was more than enough. Great bag, tons of storage. Um, this is the bag you want to bring if you're going on a day or two trip. We had all of our, our sleeping bags, and, you know, we packed a little bit too much gear, but we brought camera stuff with us, so that took up a little more space. You got to have all those supplies. This is the one that's going to hold it. The thing that I want to note about the Great Basin is that really um, it was almost a little too big for the bike we have it on. It's KTM 690 and this is a saddlebag that's designed to have a uh, connection to essentially the passenger foot pegs, which this bike has. But let's be honest, this bike isn't really designed to carry a passenger, like nobody's probably doing that. It's a little more upright, it's almost a little bit, I just found my butt kind of hitting it every now and then, especially in the really aggressive stuff. You're going through some whoops, you're hitting a jump or something, you want to get back over that fender. It's a little bit in your way. It'd be nice to be able to move back on it, you know. You get this big bike moving, you want to get your weight back to plow through stuff. But you know what? It's about sacrifices, right? If you're going to haul that much stuff, it's got to go somewhere. So there's a little give and take. I would actually put the Coyote on this bike, uh, XR650, DR650, those types of machines. I think the Coyote's probably a better option. But you know, for a little bit bigger bike, something that's actually going to carry passengers on it, you can afford to sacrifice that, uh, that seat space, then it's gonna be great. As with all of the Giant Loop products, I really enjoyed the universal fit of the, of the Great Basin bag. It adapts easily to multiple bikes, and it, and it goes on in a matter of minutes. It's very easy to take on and off, yet it's extremely secure to the bike. We're hitting some really rough stuff, some jumps and stuff, this thing, it just doesn't budge. The attachment points are super strong. The material, you know, the, the, the vinyl coated material is super strong. The zippers, that's one thing I want to note about it really. The zippers, I was stuffing this thing. I thought for sure I'd break them, but they're YKKs, they're strong. I didn't see one fail the entire time. We had all the bags out running. So uh, definitely like it. I think that it's, uh, it's going to be a great product for people who want to get as much capacity as they can and still be fairly aggressive uh, on a bike that, you know, can go off road.